beautiful rise and beautiful rise and let's see if I can make this. And I made it. What's going on, beautiful souls? I just wanted to I want to make this video. I might not make this public. Just want to chop it up a little bit, but I want to apologize to myself. It's it's a lot of things that I'm seeing again, and it lets me know that I did not learn my lesson. And I spoke about it before, or I spoke about it in a general sense. But it's, it's some things that I it's some things that I learned that I want to go over today. And 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 one of the big ones is uh, God is not going to purposely put you in. A horrible situation you did it to yourself let's just put it that way right but he will try to call you to get you out of it he's not gonna hold grudges he's not gonna hold it against you once you repent it's like all right let's go right and in my mind in my mind when i say that out loud it's like being a regular parent because children are going to do wrong they're going to do things wrong they're not do people wrong they're going to do things wrong irritate you it can get up under your skin it can make you feel some type of way but it's like they're still kids and even adults even adults go through this they they're adults we we make mistakes we're human right we're not perfect there's no one on this planet that is the term perfect we can't sit here and make it seem like we have all the answers and we're never going to get anything wrong because that's 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 not a healthy mental state to give a child or any teen that perfection is an actual thing. Perfectionism, they'll say it's 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 actually like an illness. They'll say it can it can hurt you in a lot of ways depending on depending on your other surroundings. And I'll say perfectionism because I I feel like I deal with a lot of perfectionism. Perfectionism I don't feel like is that deep. If you don't have anybody that, that's clinging on to you, like if you don't have a like, girl or like kids and stuff like that, being a perfectionist is perfectly fine, like in my opinion, because it's the other stuff that you don't have to focus on. But for me right now, it's, it's so much that I want to do. And as a man, they'll let you know, don't fall off on your passion. Make sure you stick to your passion. Make sure you're still doing, you know, what God is calling you to do. Some people don't even know how to search for that. That's why, uh, shout out to, uh, shout out to, to <laughs> he got two channels, but what is it, the Ray Ray Show? I might be off. The uh, Ray Ray Show, and then he has uh, uh, Doctor Boa. Shout out to you, brother. I've been following him for a while. He's a uh, he was one of those males that I started following uh, when the red pill was getting real crazy. But there's specific men that that still go off of the word of God. Like they're not red pill. They just understand what the situation is and they follow God's word, right? And they follow the Sabbath. I just that's the crazy thing. I just started getting more into the Sabbath and relaxing and 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 kind of understanding what it is and but i've been in church my whole life read the bible numerous of times now i'm actually studying it studying the parts that i know are uh that will benefit whatever i'm going through i crack open my bible and i might be able to find a verse for it in my opinion it's very helpful because i do i do like the word not necessarily because it's uh, it's god's word but I don't say like I stories on overcoming adversity. There's so many of them in the Bible. There's so many of them in the Bible. So I, I just appreciate being able to read and understand it. You know what I mean? And, and, and get different points of views from it. But yeah, so it's like, I forgot what I was talking about. But I want to forgive myself. That I'm saying kids, dealing with kids is hard. That I'm saying like, I said it before, but it's, I don't think, I don't think women understand let me just go somewhere. Let me, let me finish my statement before you grill me, all right? I don't think, I don't, like, a woman that never really had to truly take care of herself, and that's 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 not, that's that's that could be a good thing because her parents took care of her until she had to be an adult, or, you know what I mean, her parents was well off. That ain't got nothing to do with you. But what I'm saying is, there are souls that we're trying to, that we're trying to integrate with, we mingle with, and trying to bond with, and... There's certain life experiences that they have not been through. They have not went through. They have not have. They, they haven't had. They haven't. They haven't had to go through it. It's some people that that they the term struggle. They don't know what it is. It's some people that don't even know what a hot dog is. I, mean, like, I know it sounds extra, but I'm like, there's people on this planet. They're like that. They don't. There's certain things that they never have to go through. So it's like, well, my my mom or my dad taught me. This is what whoop whoop is supposed to do. This is what whoop whoop is supposed to do. This is how whoop whoop is supposed to carry themselves. And if your parents did a lot teaching you what others are supposed to do, 
But what are you gonna be doing for yourself? Are you just about to be standing there pointing your finger at me because your daddy was there and he and he was a real man? And that's all I'm like, it's everybody is different. It's like when it comes to having to find somebody that that suits whatever whatever mode that you have. Don't say everybody everybody grew up different. Everybody didn't have both parents. And that's why I'm like, that's why I have to shout out shout out to BOA. Cause there's there's men that are talking about this stuff to us, men. There's other men that are speaking to us. They're older. They're, they're, they're talking to us about these things. And there's certain women that you want to stay away from. And and the crazy thing is, I, and this is just my opinion, I feel like I was, I was fooled. Because when you realize people say they work on themselves, or it's a lot of, uh, as a man, it's a lot of females that's going to make, they're they going to make you feel bad because of what you want to do with your life. And that's why I said I have to apologize to myself because, like, what once it's like it's it's not as easy for every man to just kick a female to the curb you know what i'm saying like some of us we 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 created scenarios where we can't just walk away and that's why i'm like it's it's so crazy how i'm an a-hole the mother of my children knows i'm an a-hole i feel like i'm real cutthroat but then like in the same token i'm just like i know there's certain people that like if if and this, that's what I'm saying. This just might be a, a specific mindset. I gotta work my way out of it. But it, I feel like if 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 she fails in certain aspects, then I fail because we're raising the same children. So if my child sees one person failing, it's like, like dad, why didn't you? You couldn't. And that's what I'm saying. It's so it's so difficult for to have that that mindset of thinking. Just hear me, hear me when I say this. You have your kids, and it's like your kids see you, and they're like, oh, well, my dad. And my mom, they didn't have the most, but they helped each other out. They did, they did for each other. They, 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 they assisted each other, no matter what it was. But that's why I said it's so hard for for to, for a man to, to take that in and be like, like, it's so many, it's so many ratchet people out here. I'm talking about bad influences, bad for your kids, bad for your mental. You, I can't tell somebody else how their situation should go. That's what I'm saying. They, they probably got a horrible ass baby mama. They probably got a horrible ass baby daddy. They probably got somebody that, that ain't doing nothing that they ain't doing nothing for the kids. They struggling. Everybody's struggling. That was saying they using, they don't care, they don't care about what you gotta go through. That was saying they'll steal money out your that was saying it's people that got some horrible situations. And I can't say nothing about it. Right? That's why I'm just like, it's hard to take that level, that 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 way of thinking. Oh, my baby mama's struggling, I just wanna help her out, versus what I've been, what I've been, what I've been finding and researching and kind of understanding about uh who and what kind of relationships god wants in your life and seeing the signs that lets you know that some of these people may not be for you that's so difficult in my opinion that's what I'm like there's so much stuff that i see now and i have to be silent about it and i don't say that this is a good segue into the into the video that i just found the other day but it's like like the silence like having to shut up in the midst of that was saying like, you see you see you see the issue you see what's going on you know how to fix it you know how to correct it but it's like having to go silent everybody can't handle that that was saying I, I I even sucked at it for a little bit that was saying that's why I, that's why I, that's why I was in a situation that I thought I was out of that I got myself back into I I couldn't sit in the silence I was trying I was, it, it takes a while. I know I can do it. That's like, I know I. Well, I feel like I. I know I feel like I can. <laughs> I feel like I can do it now, but it's like before it was like, what was I missing? And that's what I'm saying. Like some people don't really be wanting to get themselves all the way together sometimes, and that's that's the difficult part. That's the difficult part of not overthinking, because it's, it's like every time something happens i'm like my, my brain just be like uh who am i not supposed to talk to or who am i not supposed to rock with i talked about this plenty of times before and that's what i'm saying like, I, I was good for a minute then like me and the mother of my children were talking right before the whole right before the move uh co-parent from a distance that's what i'm like sending her kids or she'll send them back and that's what i'm saying i didn't i didn't i don't know if i was willing to be without my kids it was like it's like being a man and realizing that you might have to do the whole no you can't have none of my money